Hey guys, welcome to the RZ channel and today we're going to do a little bit of a lighthearted video. Uh, I'm going to modify the uh, giveaway prize, the RK2020 version 1, and put a heatsink in it and as well as a Nintendo Switch speaker, a spare speaker inside of it because it sounds a lot better than the speaker that's inside currently. And uh, the lucky winner will probably appreciate this device even more because the heatsink is in there and the heat issues are fixed and the sound quality is a lot better so it will be a perfect device for the lucky winner if you want to be part of this uh, giveaway uh, just like the video uh, subscribe to the channel and leave a comment down in the comment section below saying i want that yeah that's all you have to do and uh, let's get into the modification process of the rk2020 So this is the insides of the RK2020. Uh, first of all, I see that the, uh, the speaker is inside, uh, recessed inside a rectangular uh, shell. We're going to clip that out of uh, the shell and then put the Nintendo Switch speaker in there. So we'll have to remove uh, the PCB. So now we're going to uh, take out the speaker. We don't need the speaker anymore because it's not that great of quality. So the plastic is now uh, snapped out of the uh, body. So now we can fit in uh, the Nintendo Switch horn speaker but we'll need to change the wires because uh, the connector is different. Now, and let's check this out. Um, as far as I can see, uh, the analog stick is seated quite well into the body, so we might be able to snap this piece of plastic off there. But uh, maybe we don't need to do that. Let's just see. So here is the rock chip uh, CPU with the RAMs over here. Uh, we want to cool that with the heatsink as such, ideally. So we need to move the battery from here uh, to over there. And we can easily do that, I think. So that is the battery out of its shell. We need to clip this off. So now the battery can move a little bit to the side, but this is in the way. So we're going to um, just get rid of this. There, we got rid of it. And now the battery can be shifted to the side, as you can see, and we can install a heatsink. There, now we have a heatsink on the PCB. We're going to uh, test fit it. Oh yeah, a slight modification that I need to do to the PCB is uh, that I need to cut this piece off so that the Nintendo uh, Switch uh, speaker will not uh, sit against this PCB and then press on it and then probably the start and select button will be too stiff to press. This is all ground copper so uh, I think it will not uh, ruin the device. There we go. Clean cut. Don't worry guys I'm an electrical uh, computer engineer so this is not really a problem for me. 
Now we're going to assemble it. So now the speaker sits uh, in front of the gap over there and it will be a lot better trust me it will be a lot better uh, with this speaker than the cheap horn that was inside of it now let's put back the shoulder buttons now the moment of truth let's turn it on Yeah, of course it boots and it has a heatsink and a new speaker in it. Let's see if the speaker works. Do some... Uh, Majora's Mask randomizer. So it sounds quite good. Let's just raise the volume. It gets quite loud. This is a Nintendo Switch speaker, so it ought to be good. Let's see if the sound distorts like with the old speaker. It doesn't. As you can hear, it sounds very good. And the lucky subscriber will definitely be happy with this. That's what I like to believe. So thank you guys for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed the video and you might want to do this uh, modification to your own RK2020. Uh, I also put a heatsink in the RGB 10, but I couldn't show off the footage, but I did show off the footage of this one. So I'm happy with that. This is the heatsink. The battery is shifted to the side and I changed the speaker to a Nintendo Switch speaker. So this will be sent out to a lucky subscriber uh, please like, subscribe, and leave a comment down below. And as I said, stay tuned, and I'll see you guys in the next video.